make, take, and go. Get ready for a lot of fun and excitement. Now, let's start. One, two, three, four, five. Make, take, and go. Well, I thought the, uh, I thought the workshop was, um, as a principal coming in, um, what was interesting is they were already going with the, uh, the activities, and I was making my rounds to some different breakout sessions, and I was able to join the group immediately and fit right in. So I was kind of picturing, okay, so let's say you've got a PE program going out there with Tandalay. A kid comes in, they've been to a doctor appointment, or they're coming in late and they're already going, they can join in at any time. Yeah. And uh, they're not waiting in a line, they don't have to figure out what's going on here. So I think the activities are um, you know, easy to explain, the kids can participate immediately, uh, it doesn't take a lot of directions. And uh, the equipment, uh, even though I, I think there's a good variety, you don't need a lot of equipment with it. Yeah. And uh, the equipment you do have, you can use in a variety of ways. So the workshop to me was uh, invigorating, just like it would be for the kids. It was great. Yeah. You know, and the teachers, the teachers enjoyed. It. The response was, well, when are we going to get um, as many materials as we can? Uh -huh. And uh, of course, the way Tandalay rolled out in our district was uh, we had two different training sessions spread uh, apart by about a month and a half. So the teachers actually had to choose to go to Tandalay and make sure they were trained. So what we got was ones from my site that got trained on either of the two staff development days, came back with a lot of enthusiasm. Um, there were two grades that everybody got trained, so they were immediately starting to plan as a group. Um, and then the other grades that uh, not everybody had gotten to the breakout sessions were saying, is there going to be another training session? Because I've heard great things about it. Uh -huh. And uh, it's interesting, you know, with the card selections, because you have those different activities with the different types yeah. of cards. They came to my office and said, we want to know where the cards are. And <laughs> our uh, teacher, who was a coordinator for the whole district, one of my kindergarten teachers, had stored them. I knew where they were. I got them out. I distributed them immediately. So they were able to, it's almost one of those, you know, uh, make, take, and go. You know, yeah. it's just one of those things where they get started right away and the kids can get going. and. The whole grade level can kind of join in. It's easy to organize. So I think that the enthusiasm was there. They could see their way clear. They could see how it was going to be run. Yeah. But um, hey, we could have spent a whole day on the workshop, and it would have been fine. The teachers would have would have loved it. Would have enjoyed it. And they really would have. What I think they would have done is start planning for their for their uh, uh, PE program uh, if they'd been given an hour, hour and a half in the afternoon to kind of do. Now the teachers have full responsibility um, with no aids at all. And uh, this one's a lot easier to set up. Yeah. So. And we're going to see how it rolls out here. I want to see the variety of the activities starting yeah. to take place. The thing that teachers have to understand is just not using the same equipment all the time. You can you can vary that. And uh, and it fits in very nicely with our character counts program, our character education program. Mm -hmm. And uh, so it blends in really really well. Make take and go. Get ready for a lot of fun and excitement. Now let's start. One, two, three, four, five. Make, take, and go.